Welcome beautiful people, I am Chef B. If you're new to this channel, welcome, welcome. Make sure you are subscribed down below. Now today's video will be all about this wig. I cannot believe this is actually a wig. Like I almost fooled myself into thinking this was my natural hair. This wig is probably one of the best wig I have ever tried. And if you guys are regulars here, you know I've tried a lot a wig so for me to say this is probably one of my favorite wigs ever y'all already know like the texture on this unit is phenomenal now let's get into some details this wig is from ywigs.com and this is their mary afro kinky texture wig and guys i just want to come closer to just that you see the texture on this now this is giving me for a natural hair type vibe it feels so soft like let me just fix that back into place the hair feels so soft like i'm about to be on some trickery in these streets with this unit because if anybody asks me if it's my hair i'm gonna say yes okay because technically it is because it's on my head so it's mine so um i'm gonna just go with that this is probably one of the ultimate protective styles that you can go with if you want to keep a natural look by protecting your hair but still have that look as if you did a wash and go so this hair is 150 percent density and i got mine in 14 inches it seems a little bit shorter than 14 inches so i'm gonna double check but i'll leave the correct info for you guys in the description box so the direct link to the unit will be down in the description box below now it is a headband wig so this is how the headband looks i did get some extra headbands to go with it but because i'm wearing purple and a pinkish bluish type of vibe i didn't want to overdo it with the hair so you can basically do whatever you want to do with a um, headband wig you could do this in a half up half down if you wish to but i'm really feeling this defined curly fro anyways without further rambling let's get straight into the video okay beautiful people heading straight into the video so i have my hair in some cornrows under this wig cap and the wig cap is optional so there's different pros and cons to wearing a wig cap with this headband wig for me without the wig cap it allows the wig to have a better secure hold on your hair because the combs will stick in your actual hair to make the wig feel more secure or for me the wig fits just fine so a wig cap is great because i don't like when the combs pull on my hair so there's your pros and cons to wig cap or no wig cap so it's optional depending how the wig fits you so this is the unit straight out of the package as soon as i saw the texture and the curl pattern of the hair i was so in love with it um, i didn't comb out the hair straight through because i didn't want it to be like um, an undefined fro so I wanted the curl pattern to stay as is so um, you should wash your wigs definitely before doing this but um, I wanted to wear this wig for my girl chat video so I thought I'll just wash it after the video like no harm because I already have on the wig cap but anyway so I sprayed the water and then I'm going to use the pick and I'm not picking the hair straight through I'm just adding some more volume make it look more realistic just take out some of the definition i didn't want it to look perfect i want it to look like maybe a two day old wash and go so i'm not combing it straight through just picking the roots as if i was picking my own natural hair to add volume so after i do that i felt like the hair just needed a little bit more shine so i'm using this hair shine mist from cream of nature from the honey line you can use whatever you want or if you don't want to use any shine at all that's fine but because this is a curly natural hair type texture when you add the mist to it it won't give like a synthetic look it will make it look even more like natural hair so i did that then it's time to prep my edges so i'm using the shine and jam um, instead of like straight edge control because i didn't want it to white up the front of my hair and also because with this i already did my makeup first and some edge control when i use it while wearing my makeup it gets the makeup all in my hair and it's a whole lot of mess so i'm using the shine and jam it will do the trick i don't want my edges to be like 
super laid down anyway i just wanted everything to just blend in and be natural so i'm not using anything like strong but um to attach this wig it's pretty simple and as you guys can see the attachable strap is really strong but not strong to damage your hair or anything because it's not going on your hair but like it feels so secure so it has three combs on the inside as i said i give you guys the advantage and disadvantage of wearing a wig cap um without the wig cap it would be super secure but i want the combs to be pulling on my hair so after i attach the band in the back then i flip the wig over and this is how it's looking but to prevent that wig looking part between the headband and the actual hair i'm going to try to fluff the hair forward so you guys are going to see me play around with it this wig was super easy to put on like this is literally applying a wig in seconds okay i wore this hair out in the streets girl and let me tell you the amount of compliments i get like i love your wash and go it's so defined your hair looks so full and i am not one to correct nobody i just say thank you yes it's my hair <laughs> like the deception is crazy anyways um i use the edge booster just a little bit to um do my edges as i said i'm trying to be careful because i put on makeup before i do this i don't normally do this but with a headband wig like it's super easy and super quick so i'm like you know what i'm gonna do my makeup first then put on the wig and it's so bomb you can imagine the different headbands that you could wear with this wig it's actually crazy you can even do it up make it like a um a puff with a headband like you can do so much with this hair you can um comb it all the way through make it even bigger like it's super super bomb like headband wigs are my fave at this point so this is how the back is looking it's super full cool and i'm just totally in love with it so all the details for this wig will be in the description box below so you'll have the link and the full details it's 14 inches and um i already gave the density i can't even remember right now but it will be in the description box down below and just look how defined the coils of the wig is it's just freaking crazy how natural this wig looks and that is all that i have for you guys today go on big up on yourself bye guys